Welcome back. We're here with my dear friend Justin Young from the High Plains Food Bank, and we are talking about the Mobile Harvest Program at the Garden. Tell me a little bit about this. Uh, yeah, I've mentioned it on here before, but it was before our truck got its yes. fancy makeover. Um, and so basically the Mobile Har Harvest Program is we have a food truck that was donated to us that we've kind of uh, revamped a little bit to basically just help us get our garden produce and any other yep. surplus produce that we run across um, out before it spoils or and, and out into high need areas. Exactly. And so right now what we do is we take it a couple times a week. Um, we, we show up at Hilda City mm -hmm. Free Clinic when they have clients and then we show up at Axe Community in San Jacinto. Um, basically just set up like a little free farmers market and let people free choice pick the produce that they need. It's a great resource for us because it allows us to get our produce out at like peak freshness. Yep. Um, and then it's also great for the food bank because we can go in anything. Sometimes we don't get the highest quality donated or uh -huh. it's, you know, it gets donated because it's kind it's of not the best. getting close to past yeah. that time. And so we can get that stuff and get it out the door quicker. Um, before it spoils. So we're hoping the end goal is to get uh, more produce out um, and have less spoilage. And you guys do this throughout the year? Yes. Okay. Yeah, so right now we're obviously not harvesting a whole lot yep. of our produce from the garden. Um, most of it is surplus from the food bank and we have a few other growers that we're picking up from that do indoor stuff. And this all obviously also helps the people who receive it because they might not have access to fresh goods. Yeah, so hopefully we're increasing access not only to the, the quality of the food that yeah. they're getting, but also just their availability to get to any kind of food. So going to a place, um, neither of those places have um, cold storage areas. Mm -hmm. You know, they might have food deliveries or whatever. So we're trying to focus on places that don't have produce distribution already, um, don't have the infrastructure for it. The, the truck is cooled. It's a refrigerated yep. truck, so we can... We can kind of load everything up there and have a little mobile unit. That is awesome. Well, we're going to be back with Justin here in just a bit. To talk